Well, hello, all my fluid art friends. Hi, Cheryl. Hi, Melissa. Let me get back over to the chat. And there's the chat. Hi, Virginia. Oops. <laughs> went to sit down on my chair and almost lost my chair how is everybody this evening i'm gonna do some more of these um resin um well they're 3d resin flowers everybody makes them into the uh everybody makes them into coasters but i am going to make them into um clocks eventually what? Oh, there it is. Oh, jeez. Oh, I can't bend over. So, I don't know how many ounces this is going to take because it says, Hi, Sally, and hi, Julie. Um, I don't know how many ounces this will take. Somebody made a mention in a video that they did that this and this and the little one takes 20 ounces so I'm gonna mix um, 16 ounces if I can never get my glove on they sent me blue gloves okay anyway here we go okay so I'm gonna mix um, 18 ounces I had um, Hi, Patricia! And I think I said hi, Julie. Did I say hi to Julie? I don't know. <laughs> My memory's failing me. Can I blame it on old age? <laughs> no, huh? Sally's a little older than me, so she's going to tell me I can't blame it on old age. Right, Sal? And I am coming over tomorrow, Sally. Um, Sunday, when I go live, I'm going to show off what Sally made me, because she said she made me something out of those uh, resin drips I've been giving her. And hello, Elisa! And hi, Tater. Hi, Zoe. I know, they're both crashed. Um, so I'm going to get to show that off. And Dina! Hey! Must not be working on your um, tree stand today. Dina's a girl after my own heart. She hunts all winter. So she's got a tree stand. Okay. And me living in um, Wisconsin, I'm around a lot of hunters. Okay, let me put this down. Now I gotta mix for probably more than three minutes because this is a full cup. And hello, Jeff. Yay, Dina! Tree stands officially finished. And wait a minute, do we have two? I'm trying to see if we have two. Do we have two Patricias in here? I see another Patricia, but I didn't look at the last name. So hi, Patricia. If, if you're I can't tell if we got two Patricias or not. <laughs> Sorry. So anyway, um, I've been watching more of these videos and picking up little things that I wanted to try with these. So that is what I'm going to do. Venison jerky. Oh, my God. I like venison. I like venison stew. Okay, do we have two Patricias in here? I see a Patricia Bogan. I'm trying to see if there was another Patricia. My chat rolls by a little fast for me. Okay. Wipe my stick up. I'm going to try, instead of putting beads around the center, I'm going to do what I've been seeing other people doing. I'm going to put some, um, um, it's leafing paper. You can't call it gold leaf because it's not real gold. It's just a thin thing like the other one. 
um, like the gold leaf. It's real shiny too and it's real fly away. <laughs> so I got a red and a blue because I'm using a rose pink and a, a, a blue diamond pigment tonight. Thank you, Elisa. I I knew I said hello to a Patricia, but then I saw no, her name again, and I thought, is there two here? I'm going to pass it off to old age and hush, Sally. <laughs> Don't pick on me. And I'm hoping that... Um, Joe Patty makes it. I um I sent her the link. Um, I don't see Robin here. Uh, Robin's painting. I'm trying to get it dry so I can ship it because I do give away a painting every Sunday. So remember that, okay? And I will say, let me see, 13 watching. I don't know if everybody's in the chat. So I'm going to say hello to all the lurkers and say hello to all the new people. Welcome to my channel. Hope you enjoy my video. I'm all about trying different things in resin and doing a little acrylic pouring and alcohol inks on the side. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the little bell for the notifications. Okay. First thing I'm going to do is, ah, I can't pour out of this cup into these little cups, so I'm just going to drizzle some in here. Because I don't need much for the colors. I hope Sally has coffee for me tomorrow morning. Hint, hint. <laughs> Is Dina leaving? Oh, yes I did. And the clock movement does fit. Um, I haven't put the video up yet. I did a video, but... If anybody has ever tried to do those clock movement hands by sliding them on, it's not easy, and I had a hard time, so I might just edit the video and cut out the 15 minutes of me fighting it and go from putting the, the nut on the movement to the, um, to the, um, to doing the, um, doing the um 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 showing off of them okay i'm gonna put some blue glitter in there and don't ask me what brand because it's uh it's a freebie that came with some other stuff and both of them i'm gonna put a little bit of this and i forgot i i didn't know i was going to use it so i forgot to put the link below to it but this is um let's see if i can get it open this is really, really pretty holographic glitter. So I don't know if the blue in there is going to cover it up. And uh, I'm just putting the same thing in this one over here. And in the red one, I'm going to add some of the chunky side of this. <laughs> oh, hi, Chris. Yeah, right? Oh, man. These holes are not big enough for this chunky glitter. Okay. This is just um, the cheapy stuff from um, Michael's. Reason I bought it is because it had um, it had a fine and a chunky on each side. Yeah, there was a lot of words that I'm going to have to bleep out of there. 
Okay, now, you don't want to put a lot of resin in there. You want to make it just into a paste. So, I'm just going to drizzle a little bit. It's maybe a teaspoon. And I am adding a little tiny bit, if you can read the label. This is by Lorez. It's called Suncatcher. And I'm going to put a little bit of this in the um, clear just to give it, you know, something nice. Oh, not a whole lot of anything in here, but there's my paste. I managed to get glitter in it. When you open a container of glitter, it goes everywhere. Glitter just creeps into everything. Thank you so much, Cheryl. Okay. Now I'm very carefully trying to spread it around, and I'm pick, going to pick up my drip right there. <laughs> spread this around the little hole. And I know that's a, what, that's a, what he said joke, but I do that, I do that a lot, don't I? Oh, don't want it on top of it. There we go. And I want to get this last little bit out of there. You can't hardly see the little post. Oh well. Okay, now I'm going to mix my blue. Hello, Melinda. Nice to see you, honey. I think I got enough resin in these. It's not really spreading out. You don't want this to spread out. That's why you make it just into a paste. And then that way it'll hopefully stay in, in one spot when you add the clear. And of course, messy, messy me. I'm getting little glitter drips everywhere. And you know, it doesn't have to be perfect because the center of all of most flowers is not perfect. And I see that, ah, uh, I am just dripping all over the place. <laughs> okay. Let me get a baby wipe. Don't want to scratch the mold, but I do want to clean up what I just dripped. There we go. Sorry that I wasn't watching chat. And hello, Angela. Nice to see you. Okay, these two are garbage. You know what? I don't have any. Well, I try to clean it up, and I seem to be making more of a mess. So that's just, it's going to have blue glitter over there. Okay, now before I mix up my colors, I'm going to very carefully, let me stand up so I can make sure I see where I'm going with it. <laughs> this cup is not easy to pick up with this much resin in it. I'm going to very, very slowly pour it out. I don't know how much each one is going to take, so I'm going to try to divide it between the two. And this one's going to need more. 
Then I'm going to pop my little air bubbles and I'm going to mix my colors. So what do you guys think the colors will do? Do you think they'll be wispy like the, um, everybody's still saying hi. Hi everybody, hi everybody. <laughs> I, I, it takes 10 minutes. Well, really 15 minutes for, for everybody to get their hellos out of the way, but that's okay. I love it that y'all are a very friendly bunch. So who thinks that I'm gonna get wispies from this like the white does? It's going to have a little bit of extra sparkle in one spot. I'm trying to I'm trying to look at the side. Okay. Yeah, I made just a little bit too much, but that's okay. Okay, first I'm going to pop air bubbles. Oh, yeah, of course, Elisa. Now I'm just going around it, popping air bubbles. Oh, you know, I forgot to put my sun catcher in. Well, fiddly D. Oh, well. That'll be for next time. tray is it on okay I had to take the clock movement off the uh off the one okay but um this is the clock movement on there you can see it a little bit through the white and this one doesn't have a hanger but I was figuring this one could stand up in a stand. Um, in the video, I do show you how I make the hole bigger. Okay, time to get make me some color. <laughs> Tarzan wearing a Batman mask. So, they do make in the colors, I will say that, okay? Now, with this paste, just like the other paste, you don't want a whole lot in there. I know it's kind of hard, to, well, wait a minute, I want a little bit more than that. I know it's kind of hard to see, but there's hardly anything in there. And Sh Sherry, how you doing? How's life in Arizona treating you? Y'all need to go check out Sherry's channel if you haven't yet. Sherry does a lot of good videos over there. Okay, this is the Midnight Blue. I know you can't I you probably can't see it, but I'm not putting that much in there. And hello, Trey and Dabo. I need to get I need to get that um I need to get something like that. And I dropped a piece of glitter in there. Uh, so let me see. It's floating on the top, so I shouldn't have to 
dig for it. There we go. Got it. And it wasn't a piece of glitter. It was a piece of, um, uh, what do you call it? Um, um, the, 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 the leafing paper. Oh, this isn't that, that opaque. I mean, it's more opaque to me. Well, it's, it's opaque. Let's put it that way. This one, well, it looks opaque on the stick because I've got a lot of the color on the stick. But watching it drip off the stick. Okay, real quick, before I start doing that, because my hand will get sticky. For those of you that came in late. Oh, come here. Come here, little guy. This is the two I made. Oh. Did I make these last week or the week before? I, for the life of me, I can't remember. Maybe you guys can. I don't know if I did these last Tuesday or the Tuesday before that. They got the clock movements on the back. I took a, um, I took a, a, a big pair of scissors, stuck one, one part of the scissor in there, and kind of twirled it to, to get the hole a little bit bigger. So, I do not know what happened to this one petal. That's why I put it at the top. I do not know what happened to that petal. The big one does not have... Thank you, Mel. Thank you, Trey. Okay. Let's see. Now this one I'm going to do I'm going to do three sets of petals, then I'm going to do big petals. I probably got way too much resin. And I don't have any molds handy. Oh well. Okay, I pinched it. You want to really pinch it to keep it from coming out too fast. Oh, this is going to be so light. I can see it now. I'll move my hand to get rid of the shadow in a, in a minute. Oops. I was pinching, uh, pinching it so hard I stopped the flow of resin. That's pretty light. I'm missing a petal right here. I accidentally missed one. Okay, let me go over some of these lighter lines. Give it a little bit more color, I hope. The outside one needs it too. Maybe I did make enough resin. Maybe I didn't, okay, well, I still got a teeny, teeny, tiny, I don't know if you guys can see that or not. Um, welcome back, Julia. Okay, did I pop, yeah, I did pop air bubbles over here. I couldn't remember if I popped. Okay. 
put that stick over there. This has got more of a bluish green tint to it. Now this one, I'm going to do like I did that big white one. I'm going to do the spiral and then I'm going to draw through it. But this time I'm going to go all the way around before I start going out. I'm trying to make more space in between them. So maybe I can keep some of the clear in the petals when I pull the petals. Well, I'm running out of room out here. Damn it. Sorry, didn't mean to cuss. This was getting in my way. Well, I got a lot of resin right there. See, it's all going to go towards the middle. So that's why I'm just kind of circling the outside a little bit. My lines do look pretty full. I made just a little bit too much. And I'm going to have to say that there was maybe about this much resin in there, which is, these are three ounce cups, so that's about a half ounce. Okay, I see a couple little lines that are lighter than the others, so. I just wanna add a little bit more. what little bit I got left in here. Okay. Sorry that I forgot to put this in. <laughs> uh, I'm going to still blame that on old age, okay? <laughs> Sally's sitting there watching me on her phone cringing. Okay, first I'm going to heat it up a little bit, get rid of air bubbles. Because I know there must have been some air bubbles. In the, um, in the colored resin. Okay. I need clean toothpicks, one for each one. Sorry that I'm right in front of the camera, but they just happen to be right there. There we go. Okay. This one, I'm going to pull it out from the, from the center. I'm not, I'm not going all the way down to the bottom. I'm keeping it right on top of the resin where the, all the color is. <laughs> okay, now I'm going to draw these in just a little bit. Not all my petals were the same size. Oh well. No flower is perfect. So, mine don't have to be. Okay, I'm going to let that one sit. While I play around with this one. Okay, first thing I'm going to do is I am going to drag from the center out. Let me get something to wipe it off with. I want to drag that, that, that ring that I put in the middle out. Oh, I didn't quite get the ring there. There we go. I'm just skimming the stick 
across the top of the resin because you do not want to go digging in there and scratching your resin. Then I'm going to do the dragging in after I do the dragging out. Okay, uh, looking this. Yeah, I can do one more right here. Now, each little petal, if you want to call it that, is going to get dragged in a couple of times. I can tell you right now, these things are going to change. Yep, that's exactly what I'm just thinking, Sherry, but it's an easy way to make some cute petals. Ugh. I am sitting here sweating like a stuck hog underneath these lights. Okay, I lost my little line that was supposed to go up here. So, there we go. There's some of the color. I just wanted to get that color out. Oops, going the wrong way. See, this one's already changing. It may not be leveled. That I don't... It, that's, that's a problem I have with this table and, and molds on trays. This one... I think is a lot better than that white one was. So, thank you, Angela. Let's see. Uh, yep, yep, it is. It is a true blessing. Thank you, Sherry. See, this one's kind of floating that way a little bit. Nothing I can do about that, okay? And my clear must have went up on top of this. Let me see if I can clean that off. Um, nothing I can do about that either. And like I said, when I, made, when I made the little drips, I couldn't wipe up that. This one, I'm absolutely loving. Not sure how this one's going to look. Um, I know everybody's probably yelling at me, stop! Just want to drag a little bit more of this color out. I got it really thick right there is what it is. Okay. Well, as they say in the movie, it's... I'm ready for my close-up, Mr. DeVille. And if anybody remembers what that's from, <laughs> then you're as old as I am. Okay. Very carefully. This one, I'm... Oh, see, it's... <gasps> I shifted it a little bit. Yep, see that, that stuff is shifting because I shifted it. That was the wrong thing to do. Hmm. 
Next time, when I fill these molds, because I tried to fill it all the way up to the top, and of course, it's only been, I'm going to say maybe 25 minutes since I mixed it. Hi, Sarah. Nice to see you. Let's see. Uh, oh, and Sonia. Okay. Uh, I didn't see you, but hi, Sonia. So, you can see they're changing even as we just sit here and look at them. Let's see how much resin I got in here. Uh, I don't have anything to put it in. Isn't that terrible? I don't know who Nora Desmond is. Was she the one that coined that phrase, I'm ready for my close-up, Mr. DeVille? Thank you, Jeff. Um, I'm not going to go live tomorrow like I did last week. Um, what I'm going to do is, is I'm going to um, do a very, very small um, short video just unmolding them and showing you how I put the hole in the middle. Okay, I, I missed I missed Elisa's suggestion, but that's okay. Um, I have no wait a minute. I do have. Hang on one second, guys. Well. I don't know how long it's been since I poured stuff out in this, but I got these little, I got these little dinosaur shaped, they were meant for ice cubes. And I think, I think I'm just going to make them just basically resin. Nope, I didn't open that one yet. Um, I mean, not resin, um, what I mean is um, glitter. So I'm just going to mix up this glitter. Yeah, well, it's almost every Sunday um, I do that. I do the giveaway. So I hope if you guys have the time on Sunday to come join me. I do a giveaway of one of the smaller paintings that I do. Usually I'll do a big one. And then I'll let the, I'll do a drawing and the winner can pick the colors. And, um, I'll let the, uh, winner pick the colors. Let me see if I can get this over. Um, because I don't know if I got enough here for all of these. But, um. And it, it's, it's in no way, I will say this, it's in no way affiliated with uh, YouTube. Because I do have to give that disclaimer. And I also say that uh, buyer pay, I mean, winner pays shipping. Now, I did have a person win that was in the Netherlands, and they paid the shipping. It was about $24. And then I had a person uh, in Australia win. And I think that one was about $27. True, true. I do, uh, I need a lot of stuff, okay? I'm going to be editing some videos this week to put up because I do have quite a few on my hard drive that need to go need to get edited and I might spend some time updating my um, Amazon wish list for anybody who cares to contribute that way and buy me little presents um, which I'm, gr I'm grateful for everything even the little two dollar donations even after uh, YouTube takes their cut on Super Chat, which 
doesn't bother me, you know. They got to make their money somehow, right? Um, you're going to make one now, Sherry? Cool. I'll be looking forward to that video. Um, but I should, um, oh, the, the donations, Trey's $2 donation, the money that I get from that will buy me a tube of paint or a pack of glitter. So every little bit goes back into the channel. I will tell you guys something personal. Because I know some of you, um, some of you, um, donated and everything. Um, I'm getting ready to make my last payment on that big bill that's been hanging over my head ever since my boyfriend died. I'm making my last payment this week on the, um, bill at the funeral home. Because it's been... I, I just, I couldn't rest until it was paid off. The last couple of payments I made was because of my, um, uh, was because of my, uh, Google AdSense, which is where my super chat comes in. My super chat, um, goes over there. So, thank you to everybody who donates like that because that helped me. That helped me pay it off, and I just didn't want it hanging over my head. Oh, yes, yes. Thank you, Cheryl. Um, even people who bought little coasters from me and um, and bought a couple of my paintings at the last auction I had when I did it with Joe Patty. Um, every little I've had money to buy materials, but um, I wanted to get that paid off. So, listen, I don't want to keep everybody too much longer. I'm making a mess. Of, still got some glitter. I do not have... Well, I'll see how much it fills this up. Yep, yeah, but unfortunately, Virginia... My boyfriend had life insurance, but it wasn't in my name. I wasn't the beneficiary. One of his kids was. And I'll be honest, my pride wouldn't let me wouldn't let me have them ask them for money. So I the funeral's done. It it the the whole thing, the whole cremation bill is paid off. Um, I even, let me see if I can find them. There they are. I got these made too the other day. I just got a, I got too much purple on the back. Um, I actually made some little hearts for my daughter and I to wear as necklaces, but I got way too much purple in there and... Yes, they should have offered Virginia, but, and I made these two little guys for his two best friends. Those are actual bullets, bullet casings from one of his guns with, a, you know, because men don't wear necklaces. So all I got to do is I got to do something with the back of it. There is a little shell in this one too. I wanted that one. So, bye, Angela. Well, it's, you know, it's water under the bridge, really. Um, 
Um, I'm not worried about it anymore. You know. I don't know why they didn't want to, you know. You know, I felt it was my obligation because he took care of me a lot the 16 years we were together. He went through, uh, um, he went through, um, me having, oh, at least four or five hospital stays over that time period. And I, oh, there we go. I dripped resin on there. So anyway, listen, I'm going to let everybody go. Y'all don't need me. I don't want to start, keep talking about it. Um, Jersey men wear necklaces and track suits. <laughs> yeah, they do. Yeah, they do. So listen, um. Thank you all for coming out. Um, I hope that you had a good time watching this. I promise you, if not tomorrow, if I can't get her, if 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 for whatever reason I need to do a, uh, I don't think I'm going to need it. I'm sorry, I'm looking at the edge. I don't think I'm going to need to do another layer. So I should be demolding these tomorrow night. Oh, oh, Trey. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're such a sweetheart. Nicole's lucky. She's a lucky girl. Anyway, um, so um, I will be, um, I'll be putting up a couple more videos. And don't forget, this Sunday, 12 noon Central Standard Time, um, I will be going live again, doing acrylics, because I got some uh, um, new paints mixed up. Thank you, Patricia. Yeah, I'm thinking of um, these going into Etsy because I need to start. I need to. St they're overtaking my um, my house, so I need to start selling some more of them. So I need to. Um, that's why I give away a painting every week. Because if I didn't, I wouldn't have a place to sleep. So you guys have a great evening. Thank you for coming to hang out with me. I hope that you. Learn something, even if you learn from my mistakes. And I hope that you are... <laughs> You're going to make me cry, Trey. And I will be at your live later, I promise. Um, uh, so I'm going to um, let everybody go. I, can, I keep saying that. So I love all of you. I love all my subscribers, all my viewers. You all are awesome. You know what I always say on Tuesdays. I love the resin right out of you. And I will see everybody in the next video. So, all I can say is, maybe for the ones who are watching the replay, watch this, watch this video up here or watch this video over here. And... Y'all have a great evening. Bye.